So cost segregation, essentially, you know, every business that owns real estate has to capitalize and depreciate that. Cost segregation allows you in an IRS sanctioned method to move a portion of that property to essentially personal property. And so you can depreciate it right now with the bonus rules immediately. It's a cash flow planning tool. We work, we work in tandem with the client CPAs and really what's gonna benefit the client best. It's the piece that all clients want, whether they have a small CPA and they're paying them $400 or whether they are paying a lot for their CPA, they want that CPA to bring ideas to the table and those forward thinking planning opportunities that they don't know about. If they're in a loss position, it's not necessarily going to behoove them right now. If they are going to sell the building, if they buy a, a developer, for example, that, that builds it, they may fund it and then they sell it. They are not a good candidate for cost seg. The number one key is they need to hold the building at least three years for cost seg to really pay for itself. And then secondly is if they're in a loss, you want to keep it in your back pocket and maybe utilize it later. I, I have sold and I'm ecstatic about this because you know, it, it, ebbs and flows, obviously marketing and sales and the whole gamut, um, over $150,000 year to date. And I just started in January, so I'm middle of August, you know, seven and a half months in, 